Kia ora. in this video I'll show you how to upcycle an old t-shirt into a drawstring bucket bag. What you'll need is a large shirt, a pair of scissors, thread, pins and a needle. First we'll start by cutting off the t-shirt hem at the bottom and use them as bag straps. Then you want to cut off the sleeves. Then cut a straight line under the collar. You want to flip the t-shirt inside out and pin the bottom together. Measure out double the length of the t-shirt, thread the needle, tie a knot and start sewing. We will sew the t-shirt shut using a running stitch. If you have a sewing machine then of course you have the option of using it instead of hand sewing like me. Finish off your sewing with a secure knot by putting the needle in halfway and wrapping the thread around it two or three times before pulling tight. Then we want to fold the top of the t-shirt down and you can either choose to sew a hem to fit your straps through or you can simplify it like me by cutting slits and weaving through it. We will also need to cut the hem off our sleeves and sew them together to make another strap. This will be used to close and open the bag. If you plan on making more than one bucket bag, then I recommend maybe switching the colour of the straps to add a bit more colour and flair to the design of the bag. Before we flip the bag right sides out, we want to create box corners to give the bag a wider base as the bag is currently flat. You want to open the bottom corner of the bag so the side and bottom stitches are aligned, then pin in place. You want to sew a straight line across using a running stitch. Repeat on the other side of the bag. Now we can flip the bag right sides out. We want to start weaving the shorter strap through the back slits, then the front from both sides, and tie a knot when the straps meet in the middle. The longer strap will be your backpack straps. You want to weave the strap through the same slits on the back as you did with the shorter strap. Then you want to pin the ends of the strap to the bottom and sew securely in place. This was such a cute upcycled bag. I hope you enjoy making your own drawstring bucket bag. Check out our other videos and thanks for watching.